hi guys welcome back to my channel my name is Hannah to smile if you are new here please subscribe down below if you haven't already and in today's video I'm going all tech on you guys so I remembered why I wanted to start my youtube channel I had a camera already I had a macbook and I didn't know how to film with my camera I didn't know what to do I mean I knew what to do but like I couldn't figure out how to feel i can't see myself because i'm using a nikon camera and it doesn't have a flip screen so i can't know what's going on behind the camera i don't know if i'm out of focus which is very tricky if you are using a standard dslr i don't know if i'm out of focus i don't know what's going on behind the camera so as long as i used my phone to film because that was really convenient and i wanted to kickstart my youtube channel moving on i did my research and i found this um software that you can use to mirror your camera to your laptop i don't think that's the case with canon cameras because i think canon cameras come to the software um that you can use to mirror your laptop to the camera but nikon doesn't have that software which is like dumb i'm praying that i get money so i can change this camera pretty soon but just before i you know stop using canon i'm going to show you guys how i have been doing it i'm using my laptop as a monitor basically because if you are filming and you don't know what's going on behind the camera it can be counterproductive like you can film a whole 20 minutes video and then when you go back to check it's like you are out of focus what am i going to do with that um so first of all you are going to need if you are using a macbook air you wouldn't need a dongle so you need um a usb a regular usb cord you need a dongle you need your macbook of course or it works for pc like windows pc too and then you need your nikon camera you need your nikon d3400 camera because that is what i have so let's get right into the video so guys the first thing we are gonna do is we are going to download the q um dslr software so you want to go to your um browser i don't know if you i use safari for the most part but i use google chrome sometimes so then you want to go and type um qdslr download for mac um let's go here it's been long so okay so oh wow this one has been here since 2014 no we don't want that one so this one last day updated 2018 so this is the one we are going to download mind you i already have it downloaded so i'm going to stop this download because i nobody got that time so i'm stopping the download and you need to f oh shoot okay 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 so when you download it and you install it it will look something like this so it will look something like that so it will pro the screen will prompt you on what to do if you use a mac it will prompt you. you already have probably have so many things installed and you know how to install stuff so it, the screen is going to prompt you on what to do when you are going to install the qsl dashboard and this is what it looks like so then you go here and then you do open it might probably prevent you from opening it at first but then there's something that you need to do to make sure that because look here it says qdslr dashboard is an app downloaded from the internet are you sure you want to open it so it might probably stop you from opening it in the first like few uses that you use it but then there's something you have to do that i can't remember right now but you're computer is going to prompt you on what to do so that it stops blocking it from opening and and every time you want to open it, it's going to look something like this so you just go open and boom here is what it looks like and sit right here and then this is where my camera my laptop is at so i can sit here and look in the camera and if i need to focus myself and stuff like that so this is my camera my ring light so here's what we need so here is the dongle thing i was talking about because you know um macbook pros i mean the latest the newest one uses this usb um 
see port so you need something to convert this regular one to this port so this is what it looks like and then oh shoot it can't come out but you know the regular usb you have to put it inside here and then this is your discretion guys so once i have that Once I have that fixed, you get this other part of the USB and then you fix it in the space right here. So because it is connected to my laptop, it's saying cannot start live view at current settings or under current conditions. So it means that app is ready for use. So let's go back and sit down and I'm going to show you how I use it. So catch me there, guys. So back here, so as I said earlier, you can open the um, QDSLR dashboard and open and sometimes sometimes it comes we are supposed to see like a couple of options right here and it to show life but sometimes when you open it directly it shows like this so what I do is just I just go back and take it out take the usb out of the camera and put it back and then it will just automatically show right here so that's what i'm gonna do right now so what advice is i advise what so see what i'm talking about so what advice is that you open up this app before you connect the usb so you just click on this live right here and boom you can see yourself and you can film in peace look you can unfocus and focus and in focus and unfocus <laughs> so it's pretty much that easy like it took me i don't know how long to find this app but yeah i had to find this app because i really needed it and it has made my work easier so far so you can see that i'm in focus right now and it's closer to me i don't know but one thing that is very tricky about using this as your mirror is that you keep looking at yourself instead of looking in the camera so yeah guys so thank you for watching this video Oh, thank you for watching this video. You know, something is really tricky right here. I'm making a voiceover and I'm screen recording my laptop. So it will look like an actual video. Meanwhile, I'm actually not recording. Oh, I could actually do this. Oh, I found something new. Okay, 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 okay. I know you guys are confused. That's what I, all those I just said. But then, yeah, that's all for this video, literally. So... Thank you guys for watching. Give this video a thumbs up if it was helpful to you. Let me know what that techy type of videos you like to see for me related to YouTube. And I mean, I'm not the best. I just started YouTube, and my YouTube is still my channel is still really small. But I'll be more than happy to share whatever knowledge I have with you guys. And please subscribe down below if you haven't already. Share this video with anybody that you think might need it. Give it a thumbs up. Comment down below if it works for you or if it was helpful. Definitely, it definitely works for me. So it's most definitely going to work for you too. So um, you can shoot me a DM on Instagram if you are having any problem. Or just leave me a comment and I can explain to you if there's anything that you need me to clarify. And until my next video, see you guys.